So, good morning, and welcome to this short video, or short, uh, I try to do uh, a morning uh, pre-check flight landing, uh, I try to do it, or at least I want to do it every day, uh, just to um, get in the rhythm of uh, doing uh, all the checks and uh, the checklist itself, uh, keep it repeated. Uh, is what I think makes it stick, or at least makes it easier uh, to get more of the actual flight time. Um, which, of course, all the checklist preps are always important. So um, I've put up uh, the um, active uh, flight data. Um, so no, nobody's flying just yet. Uh, sun is up, so officially they could. This should be live weather. Uh, it looks fine if I look outside. Uh, you guys also have the meter data. Um, so yeah, let's see how accurate that is. Uh, I'm going to... Oh, I hope that they did load us up with... Yeah, we do have fuel. Because uh, it shows live weather. Daily Airport, because that one has, yeah, see, that it has meter data. Um, winds from 270 at 12 knots, that's high. Doesn't look like the meter data I saw. Uh, so what we have, oh, we do, this, this is the correct data, 12 knots, 270. Uh, yeah. Yeah, 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 this appears correct, so that's good. Um, I'm not sure if I have to. If it changed anything. I'm not sure what it does now. Because I'm not seeing any clouds, which is true if I look outside the window, but not according to the data, I think. I'm not sure where the windsock is, but. I'm not sure if anything changed. We'll check in a second. Um, so, uh, the checks. Uh, we'll do the uh, walk around from the outside. Uh, so, that should be prop check, holes check, rivets probably check, uh, static port, uh, closed um, hinge, open exhaust. Um, Wings correct, tip of wing fine, w uh, status of wheels good, uh, free of the uh, Peter tube, mm, fuel gauge or fuel flap, uh, all hinges and cracks accounted for, side of the plane good, radio antenna clear, back flexing, open hinges, no chips or bumps, exactly, of course, naturally. Same goes for the side up, down, hinges, and static port, which should be there. So, outside checks done. Uh, today would be the 30th, uh, it would be 8.56. Uh, runway you should be 26. Uh, we'll see how the winds are. Um, 
we have all the papers on board uh, our radio equipment should be off well I think the master is on so so that should be uh, magnetos off all electricals are now off uh, fuel quantity we have 50% because we can see I'm not sure if I could see it inside the plane uh, I do because in this plane we have the fuel gauges um, fuel selector should be turned to on which they are uh, master switch on all lights on outside check to see if the lights are on so we have our front we have our side we have a strobe Oop, strobe strobe and rear so functional stall warning we can't check uh, we should turn off the master switch for now loose equipment uh, is stowed and everything's fine uh, seats are in the correct position um, he's not wearing a seat belt he should so he has to go uh, doors are closed and locked and everything's off we are going to see that all the circuit breakers are in because we're doing the starting engines check uh, we have our throttle slightly open and our carb heat is set to cold uh, the choke which is not on this plane should be fully opened and propeller area is well not really because we should do a pushback here I think uh, is clear uh, master switch on strobe should be on strobe is on uh, well they're all on actually um, ignition switch to both and I'm missing the parking brake should be set I should have said that beforehand uh, I think the parking brake is set on this unit right now it is so that's good and we are going to do our uh, ignition there she goes uh, we're going to put it back to both the throttle back to idle oil pressure should now be good It is. Um, we can turn our choke off, and everything is in the green. We are not really charging, but this virtual unit never does. We can turn on our radio, and we can put it on the right frequency. Uh, One thirty-two three five. Uh, transponder should be set to ground. Which is not ground, we got it fine. Um, <coughs> everything is okay, and we can do the flaps down. We should check that they're actually going down. Flaps up. So those are functioning. Uh, do the radio call. Um, Papa Hotel. Um, Uniform Lima, November. Uh, taxiing out to uh, runway. Good morning. A training flight, I think, but sure. So, I'm not quite sure which. I should have a button programmed for the parking. Okay, one of those buttons is for the parking. Because it did have one. Map to that one. Okay, so the last one. That's that's easy. Okay, so parking brake is off. Um, we are going to taxi. I'm not sure if I can actually taxi. If I can make that, I highly doubt it without a pushback. I'm pretty sure on the outside we are hitting things. <laughs> Told you. Okay, so. We've been braking. Uh, so the brakes work, we can turn. Oh, 
Oh yeah, and our instruments are alive. So we have vacuum. Okay, full right ladder up. Taxiing yesterday. Should now if I full right rudder. I mean, sure the thing can have left turning tendencies, but this is insane. It just wants to keep going straight, which is good. But to the runway. Stay there, do the pre flight checks. So, brakes, nose will straight, RPM low, oil temp is nice, cylinder head temp should be fine, uh, amp meter should know, well, should have set charging somewhere. Um, uh, we should brake, add the RPM, see what the engine does, switch it over to one bank, slide drop, other bank. 
does what it needs to do, back to bulb, uh, carped should hit the drop, which it does, uh, and we can throttle back to idle, uh, seats are secured and fastened, uh, things should be trimmed alright, which it is, it's neutral, uh, we can take uh, flaps to take off, which is 15, uh, doors are closed, ignition is on both, car speed is back on cold, fuel shut up valves are on, uh, radio or lights as required, which is everything on, radio is set correctly, uh, abort procedure we can talk about, so up uh, whilst still starting, uh, starting in the first section, starting when we're half there and then when we're up more, out in front at 45 degrees. Uh, we are going to line up, which we just did. We are going to do the takeoff, which is turn off the parking brake and give full force. And try and keep her steady. I think that's wind. Which is way more wind than there is, I think. So we'll see straight out. So we're just going to do a circuit. Giving it a slight right rudder. Um, flaps 400 to there. the highway. I'm trying to see if I haven't passed the highway already. Oh, there it is. So that's 700. Check to see if there's no traffic. Things in the green. Nobody's flying yet. Or at least not on the radar. Following the highway, oh, going up too much. There should be a rose, traffic rose somewhere. Also. Yeah, so I know the turning point should be around there, because I think it's in between those spots. is way too low. That's going to get me in trouble. Here, give me some flaps, reduce some speed.
That's where I need to go on the side of. Reject this approach. Ballooning a bit, I think. Not exactly center line. Okay, so uh, after landing checklists, um, oh, we should have done maybe max flaps apparently. Uh, runway, we haven't really vacated it, we haven't set the brakes, um, flap should go sit up, carpet should still be cold, which is, lights should be off, aside from, I think, taxi, and uh, transponder should be set back to ground, uh, turning everything off the way we should, ignition throttle should be closed, which it is, 3, 2, off. Remove the key, uh, put the strobes back on, or keep them on, uh, turning off the master, and check your hops. Yeah, so there you go. Have a great day.